I'm pruning a Vitex today and wanted to show a close-up of some of the cuts you're going to see me making. Um, the main idea on a lot of this is when you're cutting to encourage it to grow in a certain direction, you're going to want to make an angular cut just outside where you want to direct that growth to. Now some of these heading cuts or cuts we're making on the, uh, on the end of the branch um, are really we're taking some of the length off the branch to help thicken it up and encourage lateral growth. So as you, um, and I apologize for only having one hand here, but I'm cutting off some of the dead material, old flowers off the ends of the branches, and then just doing a couple demonstration cuts to show kind of directing that branch to where we can, we can encourage it to grow a certain way. As I get into this tree, you notice that it's, it's, it's fairly overgrown, almost touching the ground. Um, so the first thing I'm going to do when I'm pruning a tree like this is get some of the lower bottom limbs uh, to, to limb it up a little bit. While keeping the low limbs on a large hardwood tree encourages proper trunk taper, on a tree like this, taking off some of these lower limbs isn't going to hurt anything. One of the main things to remember with pruning Vitex is that a Vitex is going to bloom on the current season's growth. So you can cut these things back during the winter time fairly aggressively and you're going to see me do that on this tree because the more you more limbs you cut off the more you're going to st uh, stimulate new um, new uh, growth in the spring all of which is going to have a much better chance of blooming so when you prune it when you get into one of these things you can be somewhat aggressive and one of the main things I'm trying to do here is encourage a really nice really uh, aesthetically pleasing architecture to the lower part of the tree. Uh, we recommend that you do these uh, nearly every year um, if you want to control their height and their size and encourage really good blooming. Once they get past a certain point, um, they're really hard to trim this way once they get too tall.